For hundreds of millions of people throughout the world, tropical rain systems are a life-sustaining resource. But these systems can turn violent and dangerous, spawning deadly storms and related natural disasters. Since its launch in 1997, the Tropical Rainfall Measuring Mission, or TRIM satellite, has become the world's most widely used space-based resource for measuring Earth's precipitation, a key to understanding how weather affects and changes life here on our planet. Understanding the Earth's climate and how it responds to change relies on what we know about how atmospheric moisture, clouds, latent heating, and large-scale atmospheric and oceanic circulation vary with changing climate conditions. The physical process that links these key climate elements is precipitation. The first satellite with a rain radar and microwave imager combination, TRIM produces data used to verify and improve meteorological computer models so important to forecasters and climatologists across the globe. In fact, TRIM has become the reference standard by which rain is measured from space. You may not have TRIM up there, but you may have some other satellite up there when it is raining. Now this uh, satellite is producing calibrated information because its calibration is based upon TRIM. TRIM's data have proven invaluable for not only predicting the track and intensity of tropical storms and hurricanes, but also for forecasting the deadly floods and landslides they can cause. Not only our own uh, NOAA, but many other agencies around the world are using this data to do a better uh, job of forecasting. Data from TRIM are used to fix the location and intensity of tropical storms more than 600 times each year. To learn more about TRIM, follow its up-to-date tracking of a tropical storm, or perhaps monitor the threat of landslides and floods around the globe. Go to www.nasa.gov missions and click on Tropical Rainfall Measuring Missions.